Hi there everybody, it's Ty7EM. Um, I saw a video called Getting to Know a Transformers Fan um, by Kalel Prime, so I decided I would jump on that wagon and, and uh, do a video on that. Since it's been going on for four years, why not, right? So, let's jump right into it. Uh, question one, how long have you been a Transformers fan? Um, to be honest, I probably... Well, let me lump question one and two together because they both start at the same time. Um, first off, when I was about four or five years old, I saw my first Optimus Prime uh, G1, and it was awesome. I loved it, but I didn't touch it because it wasn't mine. And uh, the second part to that is when I was about ten years old, I went into a Walgreens. <clears throat> I went to a Walgreens. And uh, I went to their toy aisle, and I saw some Transformers there from Beast Wars. And I, I don't remember, I don't remember the the full name of this character. Uh, it, I, I believe it was Armadillo. Uh, he was an armadillo um, that had like a quick transformation spring. You pull up his tail, and his head would flop down, and it would reveal the robot head. And the, uh, the feet were actually his guns. So I thought that was super badass. I had to have it. And that was probably that was probably the first Transform I ever owned. And uh, I don't have it anymore. I really don't know where it went. Um, but that's kind of where it all started. Um, I didn't really get a chance to collect Transformers um, un up until a couple years ago. But... Anyways, uh, question number three. Who is your f most favorite Transformer of all time? My most favorite Transformer of all time... I know a lot of people are going to say Optimus Prime. Um, but I actually really like Ultra Magnus. Um, and, I mean, he looks cool, but I think what he really stands for... Um, is what really you know draws me to him just the fact that he he's responsible you know that that really uh that really rings a bell for me and i'll answer that later on um but his honor his loyalty his trust uh his patience really kind of sets him apart from everyone for me and that uh, ultra magnus holds a special place for me um the next question is, what is your most prized Transformers possession? Um, my most prized possession is probably behind me, but I'm not going to reveal him just yet because I've been saying that I wanted to do a review on him as a surprise if you watched my collection video. Um, but the guy next to him would most probably be my masterpiece Optimus Prime with the trailer. Um, he's way awesome. Uh, you can, uh, you can kind of, it's really bright back there, but that's because Optimus is so awesome. Um, so, okay, moving on. Uh, outside of Transformers, what do you do with your life? Um, I work for a startup company called Digital Solutions. Um, we specialize in torque products, and, uh, I... I also, I used to play guitar. I do every once in a while when I hear something good uh, on the radio that I want to play. I look up chords and I strum on it, you know, I strum my guitar with it and I sing and all that good stuff. So, um, there, there's that. Um, I, uh, let's see, I hang, out with, I hang out with my family a lot. My family really means a lot to me. Uh, my siblings are, are awesome. Um, I'm engaged, so uh, I spend a lot of time with my fiance, and uh, I think you know honestly that's pretty much my life. Um, right, moving on. The origin of my YouTube screen name. So this is going to explain why I enjoy Ultra Magnus so much. Um, Ty seventy M. Uh, it's two parts. Ty is my middle name, so that's me. Uh, seven is for the number seven, and in Vietnamese, EM stands for AM, which means younger sibling. So I have seven younger siblings, um, I'm the oldest of eight, 
and we no half brothers, no half sisters. We're all full, same parents and everything. And yes, I've heard it. I've heard it all. My parents must have been so busy. They were getting busy. Gross! I don't ever want to think about stuff like that. Think it. Think to yourself. Think to yourself. Um, and what else was there? Uh, if you had a couple more members, you would have a full baseball team. Yeah. <laughs> we could, except no one really plays sports in my family, except for one. Um, well, maybe one and a half, two. But, <clears throat> anyways. Excuse me. Uh, that's kind of where my name comes from. Um, I Growing up, I've always had to... You know, be be the standout. I always had to uh, be the one that sets an example. I have to be the one who has to be responsible and take care of the kids. And I think that that's going back to question uh, number three. That that's why Ultra Magnus is such a big deal to me because he's in the background. Like if you go into a battle, you know that you're going to be safe because he's always going to have your back, and he always knows what to do. And I think that's that's one of the big reasons why I love Ultra Magnus. But all right. So, anyways, moving on. Um, so, question eight: Whose videos do you enjoy watching? Um, I'm subscribed to a bunch of people. Uh, not a bunch, but I'm subscribed to some people, and uh, you know, uh, all you guys, Juice for Triple X, um, the Zizzler Gears. Uh, you know, there's a bunch of guys out there. I actually really enjoy watching uh, the Transformer reviews. A lot of you guys are helpful because your reviews also include how to transform something. And uh, I needed that for Masterpiece Skywarp right there. Uh, I had no idea. I bought them, um, and I had no idea how to transform them. It didn't come with instructions. And I was freaking out because I was afraid that would break something. Uh, and he's a masterpiece. You know, you don't want to... I don't want to screw anything up, so I got over that. I started doing a bunch of like mods to cut them up and stuff, and put a new head on them. So I'll, I'll show them later on another video. But um, I mean, other than Transformers reviews and stuff, I personally really like to watch uh, the Wong Fu production stuff. I like watching Kev Jumba, um, Ryan Higa. I I like watching like uh, uh, just those guys. Just their comedy kills me. Um, I like watching David Choi. That whole group of guys, they're they're all they all seem like really cool guys, so there's those guys. Um Question number nine. Uh which Transformer is your holy grail? Uh my holy grail has not been created yet. And with me spilling the beans about how I want how I love Ultra Magnus. My ultimate holy grail is an Ultra Magnus masterpiece. I know they made it already, but an Ultra Magnus masterpiece with the trailer that makes up his power or his power armor or whatever it's called. That would be awesome. I've been looking for that. I've been looking forward to that. They put some teaser pictures out, but nothing yet. Um, Hasbro and Takara Tomy are still milking the Seeker mold, so you know, good for them if they want to make money that way. But you know, I've I've already, you've, if you've seen my rant videos, you know what I'm talking about um, about giving us what we want. So that would probably be my holy grail. I would be the first one in line to. Well, okay, maybe not the first one in line. I'd be fighting for a spot to be first in line, and then probably end up being like tenth because people would sneak in front of me. <laughs> but anyways. Um, that that's that that would be my holy grail. Last question is: If you could transform into anything, what would it be? Because, let me, you know, I, I I never really thought about that before. Um, I would probably be okay, probably an eighteen wheeler with a trailer because trailers are badass and they turn into cool stuff. So, uh, I would be completely unassuming. Uh, <laughs> But I would probably be an 18-wheeler because they're badass. There's really no other way to put it. Um, I mean, if an 18-wheeler rolled up next to you on the freeway, would you stay next to it? I wouldn't. I'd get the hell out of the way, which I have to do because uh, some 18-wheeler drivers, most of them are all right, but there are some that just 
don't see me because my car is too tiny, I guess, or whatever. But um, anyways, that's what I would. I guess. Well, uh, thank you for watching this video. I know it's kind of long, um, but you know I want to thank Kel L Prime for putting this together. Uh, I and letting us get to know each other better. Um, so hopefully I'll see you guys later on this week for a review. Uh, and I will see you later. Thank you very much for watching. See you later. Bye.